welcome back to Ember Tech. So today let's connect the Linux air purifier to the phone so we can control the Linux from anywhere in the world. So first thing first, go to the Play Store and download the Linux app. For me here, yeah, it's in Europe, so let's then order it. It's ready and downloaded, so let's open it. Okay, allow at all time, allow. start okay so I entered all my credentials now let's at the end Set and connect to the Linux Smart Wi Fi network via device menu settings. So we go in here. We find Linux Smart. Connect to it. That's done. You agree to this condition, obviously. You press finish. And in a few seconds, the app will pop up like this. The Linux will connect to the Wi Fi that you are currently connected to. So make sure you are connected to a 2.4 GHz Wi Fi because the Linux doesn't know a 5 GHz one. So please be sure to connect to the, to, to the 2.4 GHz Wi Fi because if not, the Linux will not connect with it. All good, good. It explains everything, but it does the app. You press close. And there, you will connect to the Linux. It's all connected. It's showing us what is showing us on the Linux. As you can see over here. The Linux is full. On the foreign export, and you can do anything with it. Let me show you. So, if I press over here, as you see, you can go higher and turbo. Okay. Higher, the Linux will go higher. You can hear it, maybe, and higher. If I go turbo, of times you want to turn, you want to turn it. Of times you want it to turn on, turn off, like this. Any time and day and everything basically. Just like a calendar meeting. You can turn off and on plasma wave, and you can turn on and off the lights like this. Off. And on. You can turn off and on plasma wave. As you can see. And you can do all this from anywhere in the world. Let's cool it down a bit. You can put it in auto mode. And obviously, it will go on auto mode. Okay. 
if you go back, you will see it's already fair. So it's working very good. And the Winix is fair as well. So now the second part. Let us connect it to Alexa. So you go to Alexa, the Alexa app, you go into skills, you type Linux over here, and you have three skills. Choose this one and enable the skin. When it's enabled, I will disable and enable it for you again. So you can see what happens because I already enabled it. When you enable it, it will ask you for the email and the password you entered when you were entering the winning set. You enter it, it will give you like this. Winning smart home skill has been successfully linked. When? Now. You just go to devices and you go to all devices and you will find device over here. You will find it as Winix. Purifier, you can edit the name so Alexa will know what you are talking about. So I will name it Blue. And it's named Blue in the Alexa app now. So when we go find it, we find it as Blue. A purifier. Now, what can we do? With this. You can do like this. Set blue to high. As you can see, setting it to high. Turn off blue. Sorry, what device? Blue. As you can see, it turned it off. And you can do this obviously from anywhere you are in the world. Let's try again. Turn on blue. Sorry, what device? Blue. Ask Winix what is the indoor air quality? Okay, here's Winix custom skill. Your air quality could be a problem. It's highly recommended to keep running the air purifier till the quality gets better. Thank you for watching. That is all for today. Please subscribe so I can do more videos like this. And press like if you liked it. Dislike if you didn't like it. And please comment of what can I do better for the next time. Thank you and have a wonderful day.